guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you how to spin a pen on your finger. Here's a performance. Alright guys, so this is going to be a very in-depth tutorial on how to spin a pen. This I'm just getting this pen. It's a normal ballpoint pen. It's I'm pretty sure it's a gel pen. And you can buy these at the store. Or I'm also going to show you how you can use this type of pen. But really any pen works. So the first step in spinning a pen on your finger is your hand placement. So the very first thing you want to do when you're getting ready to do this is you want to find the middle of your pen and you can either just guess the middle or if you put the pen in between your thumb and your pointer finger like this and then you just slide in, your hands will naturally go to the middle and then in between your two thumbs is the directly middle of the pen. So then once you're there, you place your pointer on in the middle and normally it will tilt one way or the other this pen is pretty much equal so like with this one you find about the middle then it tilts this way like that so that is the first step and you want to do that so that you know which side to put your hand on. Because you want the heavier side to be those sides spinning around your thumb, so that's easier. And with this pen, if it's like the same weight, I usually like to use the back of the pen. Because then it's like, then if you wanted to, you could spin it and then write it right away or something. I don't know. But this one, you're going to use the front because it's the heavier side to do it with. And this pen... I think it's more difficult because it's a lot lighter than this pen. So the heavier the pen you have, the easier it is. So now, when you're placing your hand, you're going to take your pointer finger, and whichever side is the heavier side, you're going to place it on the end of that side. So with this one, I'm placing it right here on the part that you would push in to clip the pen. So you have your pointer there, and then you're going to take your third finger, and reach down to about half of the pen and place your third finger there. Then take your thumb and place it slightly in front of your th where your third finger is. So it should be about a finger length, like if you had another finger right here, it would be about that much. So you have your pointer finger in the end, your third finger about halfway down, and then your thumb a little bit to the right of it. So, and then once you have that done, you're just gonna practice with your third finger, you're gonna push the pen. And at first, you just wanna like spin it off your thumb. Don't worry about catching it, just spin it. Work on the spinning motion. You can do the same thing with this one, pointer, third, well, thumb, and just spin it. And just keep doing that until you feel comfortable with that motion. And eventually, you'll start kind of catching it a little. And just keep working at the spinning, and it will eventually just come right where you want it, right in the middle of your hand. And what I like to do is, so you're starting with the back of the pen that's spinning, and if you just go one time around, then it will end up like this. And you want it to be facing the same way you started it as. So it's starting this way, so when I end, I want it to be facing the same way. And when you're first starting, you might just get like a half spin, like that. And that's fine too, but to make it look the best, you, can, you want it to be facing, you want to get a full 360 degree spin. And it is possible to do two spins, but I, whenever I do that, it's mostly because I just got lucky. 
So it would kind of look like maybe, let's see. Yeah, it's, but if you wanted to do two spins, you would have to balance it on your thumb for longer. And I think, personally, one spin looks just fine. So, let's recap. So you're gonna pick a pen, find the balance point, and then with that pen, point your finger on the end, that is the heaviest, third finger about halfway down, thumb right in front of it, and then just push with your third finger and have it spin off your thumb. And then eventually you will get into spinning all the way around and catching it. So this, the actual name for this is a thumb around spin because you're spinning it around your thumb. So hope you liked that video. Don't forget to subscribe. Yeah.